Candio show on the last episode. You can't show them folks that you're a real street nigga without having a chop and, and nigga, if you're a real street nigga, what it does that? Like, what the fuck are you talking about? I was, I'm telling you, I was a real street nigga. I was doing the street shit, but now I'm doing this music shit. I'm not actively trying to be a street nigga no more. I'm trying to be this now. That shit right there, obviously wasn't what it was. I'm trying out this rap shit now. When it was time to do street shit, I did street shit, but this ain't the place to do no street shit. It's the rap game. But now the rap game has, has turned into a gladiator arena, arena where you have to do the fucking most. Like, if you don't have, as I, I'm trying to show you on this video, if you don't have money, guns, and dope in the video, then you're not about that. You ain't, you ain't on that. You know what I'm saying? Like, you not, they ain't you for real like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you a real street nigga, you, you should have access to all kind of pistol, Dracos, everything. If you don't got none in your video, like, you just, you know what I'm saying? You just talking. Everyone is watching the game. We know that putting anything on social media, they can use this shit in court. But you have to do it once you come in this rap shit, because if you don't, you're not going to skyrocket your numbers ain't going to do what they need to do. Because nobody believe you. We need to see you buying this kind of jewelry. We need to see you posting up your street, letting niggas know you, they can come get it anytime. If you're not acting like that, then you're not really that. That's how people gauge who's really about that shit and who's not. Because no one can tell through the camera lens who's who. You need to make sure. So a nigga got to kill a nigga on camera. And we just have this right now. Because we're in a talentless age, people are settling for infamy over fame. A famous person is, you know, Bruno Mars and, you know, Lady Gaga, Usher, and shit like that. An infamous person is Welvin the Great, um, Wide Nick, uh, Long Nick, Daddy Long. Uh, no, see these motherfuckers. You're just up, uh, or the motherfucker who shot a nigga on camera. You're infamous for being the bitch who um, got fucked on camera. You know what I'm saying? It's a difference, but I guess because it, they kind of have similar perks. You know what I'm saying? I guess motherfuckers can't tell the difference. Because everybody know you when you go out and shit like that, but what do they know you for? And my issue is, an uh, infamous motherfucker... Can come right into this rap shit and skyrocket. Candio show. Hey, it's Candio. Like, comment, subscribe, share. It's cool. Subscribe to Big Facts Podcast, Rap Trap, and Stupid Rappers. Brand new top in the charts is Ichabod Cocaine, the headless H Man. He's always slinging that H. He's always slinging that horse. That's right, Ichabod Cocaine. The headless H man with his new hit single, Give Me Some Head. Give me some head. Hey, hey, give me some head. Give me some head. Give me some head. Hey, hey, give me some head. Hey, hey, give me some head. Give me some head.